Welcome back. Tonight we're recapping the damage in central Georgia after strong storms, including a tornado hit parts of the area. Crisp County was hit by an EF1 tornado with winds at a maximum of 100 miles per hour, according to the National Weather Service. Fallen trees crashed on homes, yards and power lines. Crisp County Sheriff Billy Hancock estimated 36 homes were impacted. And the National Weather Service was surveying in Houston County after a possible tornado touchdown this morning. The Centerville area saw most of the impacts from the overnight storms, but a lot of the damage was very minor. Flint Energy's trucks were out today getting power back up. Most of the area got their power back on by early this morning, but some homeowners still saw scattered outages throughout the day. When severe weather bears down, how do you get warnings? Some people say they weren't warned about this morning's severe weather in Houston County. One viewer in Centerville posted on Facebook saying she could not hear the tornado siren and she was wide awake during the storm. Simone Souble verifies if the sirens sounded. Wednesday morning storms led to several tornado warnings in Georgia, including one right here in Houston County. Some people are talking about the tornado sirens, whether they sounded and whether people could hear them. She called and said, because I couldn't hear the sirens, the rain and the thunder and lightning. And she said, Mom, the sirens went off and a tornado has been spotted. So let's verify. Did tornado sirens sound during the overnight storms in Houston County? Yes, they did. And here's what our sources, the Houston County Emergency Management Agency and the National Weather Service have to say. Houston County EMA Director and Fire Chief Chris Stoner said these sirens aren't designed to wake you up. Those sirens are designed to alert people that are outdoors, not in their home or in a building, um, in enough time to be able to seek shelter into a building. Um, if you can hear those inside your home, that's a, a luxury. The farther out you go, uh, the, the worse the weather conditions are. And according to the National Weather Service, even if a siren is nearby, they're intended as an outdoor warning system, and you may not be able to hear it inside your house. When you hear sirens, don't call 911 to ask what's happening. Instead, listen to your weather radio, local radio, or TV for warning information. We heard the sirens going off. I even asked my neighbors if they heard them, and they did. And I haven't heard of anybody being hurt, so that's such a blessing too. So we can verify, yes, the tornado sirens did sound throughout Houston County during Wednesday storms. With your Verify, I'm Simone Souble. Chief Chris Stoner said there are 33 tornado sirens throughout the county and they are typically placed in larger, more populated areas around schools, sporting venues and parks. To get more stories verified on your own time, download the 13WMAZ app on Roku and Amazon Fire TV.